loser named Tipster that I predicted his downfall years ago. He's nasty. Nobody believed me. I told you guys he was going to delete all his DMs because he had a lot of nasty, disgusting stuff in there. And I was right. He also abandoned his friends like I predicted. And I was right, man. Yo, I'm telling you, you're going to hear me say I was right a lot of times during this, but whatever. Let's get straight into it. Apparently, RC debated not only Tipster, but he debated Keffles. If you want to go watch the full stream, go to his channel. He has it playlisted. Go and check that out. Now, let's check out uh, Blimster and Keffles. Ke Tipster's going to jump in for Keffles. What happened to his wife? Where's his wife? Well, he's going to jump in. Let's play this, man. Tell me how the audio sound. I want to make sure audio is not too low or anything. Let's play. Hello. Yo, what's up? You got fucking mogged by Bo Blacks. I mean, let's just let's just okay, set the record straight. Oh, really? this, we'll try to shame this him for like an debate. hour about how a joke that he made in his private that nobody saw was somehow offensive and undermines all of his like pro trans advocacy for fucking years. You realize that right now you're the one screaming. You're the one acting like an SJW. Yeah, he just to the That's not going to work. You're stuck in 2016. You're an SJW. Is that really a line of argumentation you're going to use right now? Is you're an SJW? I mean, for the people yes, that sit you're, there and claim that people are out. stuck in you 2016, really that's a 2016 emotional argument. Attitude where you can never come from anything logically. And that's the your biggest The only emotional flaw. attitude that's being displayed here is from you by looking at a tweet Why that Bobax made. Then? I'm not yelling. Give some of you guys context. Uh, Bo Blacks is another content creator. A lot of people that's woke try to cancel him for saying the N-word in a song. He made a song about Black Lives Matter and was saying all his other stuff. And who cares? Who I don't give a damn. He actually came on to my stream. I might upload that. I still have the footage for that, the VOD. Um, he came on to my stream years ago, like when that happened, and actually laughed about it. Right. So what what people always pull that up about Bo Blacks. I think out of his like friend group, he's probably the the least toxic. He has his uh, his uh issues. He'd be yelling, let me speak. You can get emotional. Other than that, he's like the least toxic from a distance. Um, I think he also strikes somebody too as well. And people consider him a hypocrite. Um, when it comes to me, I'm not against striking um for copyright if someone just re-uploads your whole content, right? I think that's stupid. I disagree when Bo Blacks does it. Archive my ass. That that's dumb. Yeah, no. Right. Um, and also someone's doing like a reaction and they barely saying anything or not even a reaction because I'll let a reaction rock. Who cares? That's fair use. Right. But someone will use a long 30 minute clip of your video and be like, what? It was fair. You No, no. Just because you talked 10 seconds in the beginning and played my shit for like 45 minutes and then talk after that does not make it fair use. Right. So I think that with the whole commentary community, they got the whole fair use and the copyright thing wrong. Yelling, I'm talking to you. You are yelling. You should calm Do down and actually yelling? have a civilized conversation. Wait, are you, are you upset? Do you think this is yelling? Calm down, buddy. It's fine. This is... You're really going to project like that onto me? <laughs> is this entire call just no you? I mean, this is some weak shit right there. I expected better. This is no you. I want to get off on equal footing and actually just talk. What is the issue that you have? Uh, I think that your criticism against Bobax is completely fucking retarded. I don't even you're think you there, understand what the criticism was. The criticism is that A, Boblax was sexually harassing you, which is hilarious. And B, that Boblax making a joke That's in his true. account. Boblax made a joke involving how he... It was some joke. It was like a flirty joke involving him and someone who might have transitioned within their life. And this person is trying to use that as a claim for how this guy is, you know, phobic. As well as pulling up the old Black Lives Matter stuff. That's what Keffles is doing. Keffles actually popped up and donated in my chat once. I think it was because I was talking trash about uh, Hunter Avalon. Yeah, I might talk some more trash about him <laughs> soon. Real soon. Means that he was transphobic against you. That doesn't make any fucking sense. Well, because he said okay. trans women aren't women, but I'd fuck the shit out of them. Lol, on account that nobody saw. Really? You're going to sit there and act like that's harm or that's violence? I don't talk about you. So you think pronouns oh, are you bullshit want to change now? The subject. You're just going to start so you're going to change people? the subject now because you can't answer for I'm not, your I'm failed not changing the subject. confrontation you're going against Boblax. You and you're trying to dissect a you conflict lost. that was already 
It just wasn't so resolved. Bo Blacks thinks you suck. He wrote it in the chat. You lost. I, I don't think you're going to get Keffles to admit that player. <laughs> that's the, I think that it's clear as day that Keffles is only bringing this stuff up just to take shots at Bo Blacks right now. And I'm not even caping or defending Bo Blacks. That's just the truth. Um, like, I don't know why people act like they're so offended. It wasn't a win or a lose. There was a conflict over a misunderstanding. Well, I we think you lost. I'm watching this right now. And this is a big fat L. You got ratio. Sure you call. think of a lot of things, little buddy, but you don't understand the world around you very well. That's amazing to hear from you. <laughs> you <a> little buddy. <laughs> yeah, you lost. You fucking lost. What do you want to say? Lost what? This wasn't a debate. Your argument. Okay, well, let's talk about this then. Because we could talk about the pronoun stuff for a second, but I want to stay on topic here. I don't want you to pivot. You sat, you actually thought that Bobox making a joke in his it's private true. account it's meant that he was somehow transphobic? Fucking pronouns or any of this shit. Hello? But Hello? again, it's not enough. So fuck it. So you're just playing a call? Anymore. We can talk about pronouns. pronouns. Let's talk about Boblax. But you don't want to talk and about I'm it. You're just pivoting screaming. because you lost. Like you I failed. Don't. You're just playing the stream that I said before. Pronouns are bullshit. Okay. I just said it right now. Now, can we talk it's about the subject enough. that's at hand right now? Can you just- he wants to debate about a person. You should just let the person debate them. I, I would prefer that, Augie, but I can see how you're... I guess defending your friend. I'm not even mad at that, to be honest. I just think that like debating about a person, you should just let the person do the debating. Right. Um, I can understand if Kefu's called in and I guess you were talking about the situation and they wanted to say their piece, which would be foolish on Kefu's behalf. I don't think it matters at the end of the day because of her fan base and um Augie's fan base are like almost polar opposites, even though they act almost identical to some degree when it comes to like the intensity. Um, that's not me saying that RGRC fans like dox people and none of that stuff. I don't think that they've gone that nasty, but smearing someone's name, of course, because RGRC in the past would just, because he's mad at you, accuse you of something, and then his fans would just go with it for life because that community thinks that's funny. <laughs> for, for somewhere, they think that's funny. They make songs accusing people of crimes and just going around spreading it and promoting it to where for years people will accuse someone of, of a crime because of the, these like fake allegations that they created because they thought it was a funny song. Like that's what Augie RFC's community does. I think that's extremely toxic and disgusting, especially in today's climate. And then you got Keffles who's doing that plus the docs and the stuff like that. If I had to say which community was more toxic, of course, I would probably have to go with Keffles. I still think that Augie's community is toxic. And to be honest, that might not necessarily be a bad thing if you are him. You might like that type of ish. It might, it might not work in his favor maybe in the years in the future when he matures a little bit. He might have an I-dubs moment. Who knows? Say, oh, well, there, there he goes. Mask this off, is I agree with this. Shit. He's transphobic my entire fucking career. So fuck it. Fuck I'm it. I'm going mask off. I'm going mask it, off. I'm really glad because you've been a pussy up until now. Why? Like, I know that you believe those things, but you would never say so it. So what do I believe? So like this entire By the way, you're pivoting, by the way. Started. So you've completely surrendered the p- argument that Bo Blacks, you lost the conversation with Bo Blacks. No, 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 you're no, You completely no, 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 surrendered. No, no. The entire Augie, chat is Augie, telling you that you're a coward. Augie, Augie, please shut the fuck up for a moment. Are you just mad? Listen, okay? Are you mad? Calm down, I'm, buddy. This is not a conversation that a bunch of things are going to get achieved from. I'm going to let you know that right now. This is not a conversation where any knowledge is going to be obtained. At this point, it's already, it's already out the window. It's already out the window. Now this is blood sport. This is not actual debating, which I'm fine either way. Oh my god. <laughs> you need to calm down. It's really okay. Really it's okay. Do we yeah, can have a conversation, you know, but if you're gonna pivot have a and change topics, then we're not gonna not pivot. Okay, let's talk about Bobo. You don't then. understand the context in which this started in the first place. We can talk you're coming about Bobo. Like, oh, this is known, this is known. But it Listen, wasn't a debate. We can talk about pronouns, but first we were let's talk trying about to resolve a previous conflict. Okay, and you lost the conflict was stupid. The conflict was completely retarded. The conflict, explain the conflict. I've explained explain this multiple times, but I'll explain it again. Okay. The conflict that A, Bo Black sexually harassed you, and B, it wasn't is about sexual harassment. And really? It wasn't about That's the, the argument you made on Twitter. They fighting over Twitter. That's what the argument you made Twitter? on Twitter. This, this started over a month ago. 
And maybe if you went on less... And this entire thing with Bo Black started over a month ago. And what maybe you if say? you listened more to the conversation instead of going no. on InfoWars Nick Fuentes ass rants, Nick you would Fuentes actually understand. Rants. Are you really coping this hard? How is that cope? You're sitting there acting like I'm in this crazy extremist. I've been listening to the call and giving my commentary the entire time. You can sit there and say it's crazy, but that's just to cope. What are you going to just show your fucking power levels already? Uh, you said I already did. I am showing my power levels right now. You just you just complimented me for going mask off. You don't even know what argument you're making. You're so lost. Yeah. No, that was actually pretty. <laughs> yeah, no. Uh, uh, I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Fuck. I know you don't, but that's fine. No, I'm I'm, like, this is what's <laughs> I'm mocking you, you idiot. I'm making fun of you. I'm I swear when I do blood sport, I'm way better than this. I got it. I don't want to be like the the almighty, oh, I'm the best. I'm better. There's a reason why that whole community runs from me. Right? And it's too late. Don't come to me asking for debates now. It's done. I chased y'all for a year. And y'all all blocked me and ran. Talking to you, DREO. This mother had the nerve. Go on Twitter. How come everybody that talk crap about me, they disappear? When I unblock them, now they don't want to say nothing. I make a whole documentary about them. He act like he don't see nothing because he's scared. Him, tipster, Augie, eh. He might just, he might try to hit me with the you ain't worth my time shit. But it's really because he, he know he can't do none of these tactics against me. Real talk. Real talk. What he need to do is get me as a mentor so I can teach him how to stop being an incel. That's facts. I can get him out that hole. Quite aware of what you're saying. You don't even, you're not even aware of shit right now. Do you want to talk about Bo Black? So you just no, want to no, fucking no, no. shit fight? Uh, because you wouldn't let me talk about the context to begin with. So we okay, went into this it. back and forth of calling other arguments. Let's hear it. The original thing was because he said that I needed proof that his friends were transphobic in order to claim that his friends were transphobic. You just went messed off. You just admitted you're transphobic. I that won. That is not at all he what lied. I just admitted. Only I don't care about pronouns. Like you. I don't care. Yeah, of course. Are you going to Are you going to moderate the people dead naming me in your YouTube? You were chat? already calling me transphobic before I even said that, right? Oh, okay. all right. So she was uh, tripping out. I think they both bugging out, but whatever. I think this is pointless at this point. This is blood sport. There's no who got the better point. Oh, I said bit, 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 with my eyes. Up. Who has the better points? <laughs> It's just more like just them just insults and whatever, whatever. Oh, so you're not going to. I don't fucking honestly, so if I'm being care. honest, I really don't give you a don't shit about care. words. So you're that's trans- all your argument just fucking is. Admit it. You stop being a pussy. You were calling me transphobic before this stream even took place. Dude, you waited for I the stream to happen. You want me to be transphobic so it can fit you. your victim status more. It's just it's a grift. People see right through it. I don't have a victim. If status. I'm transphobic, you're, you're just a grifter. You're, you're selling bullshit to, to your audience to make money you're off the of one them. You cemented the fact that you think. Do you that think that just by being trans, trans that means that you're suddenly this like trans messiah that can grip money off of them? You don't care about shit. What you want me to be hateful about? to you? That's your entire existence business. online is perpetuating exactly a victim like status so that you can farm extremist. money out of your simps. It- she definitely is a victim. That's that's like literally her and tips is her whole thing. That's why they bonded. That's why they bonded together, man. That's why he was sliding them DMs. That's why he all underneath those pictures. That's why he flirting. Why does Kefla have a problem with Bo Blacks flirting when Tipster flirt all day, every day? That's kind of weird. But whatever. Maybe Tipster's wife is okay with it. I, I don't know their dynamic. I don't know their kink. It's but just, you realize this, right? It's you been realize exposed. this is why people You've call you these things, right? I wasn't exposed. You were calling me this no things far before my stream today. It doesn't matter. That no was my entire point. Fuck pronouns. It doesn't chat. matter. I can be as nice. I can be as mean as I want. It literally doesn't change shit. You're always going to call me transphobic at the end of the day. So fuck it. I don't care. That was my point. Oh, oh don't even. Cu- That's such a cop out. That's a cop You're going to be like, oh, oh, the transes were mean to me. I'm going to finally be transphobic. Dude, you want me to be mean to you so you it. can pretend to be like a victim. You're a big medical fan. Can you at least have as much balls as Jim? I'm transphobic. Thank you. Thank you <laughs> I mean, do you want me to just say it flat out? Like, I don't give a oh, fuck. No, You're going to call me it either way. You understand that this means nothing. You're going to call me it either way. It doesn't matter. It doesn't fucking matter. 
because you perpetuate a victim status to sell you. you perpetuate a victim a status victim to sell status. bullshit to your audience. You want me to be transphobic so say? you can sit there and act like transphobic YouTubers are calling me out, man. Fuck. What, what, so you can get okay. money. From- Why you put the shaggy from Scooby Doo voice on? <laughs> he put the shaggy from Scooby Doo voice on. Like, whoa. Well, that was not necessary, pimp. That was, that was a little extra. That was a little extra sauce. Okay, okay. so, okay. Augie, Augie, do you think trans people have like special status that they're using to oppress you? Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Then actually. You're playing the victim card. That is you being a perpetual victim because that's not the conversation. In the you wanted world. me to be transphobic from the start. You've been calling me. Tra- Can you explain why no, I was transphobic before the stream today? Can you explain why I was being transphobic before the stream today? Are you not going to answer question. that? Oh, you don't want to answer that, do you? What? Pretty what sad. Is the question? How was I what transphobic the before the stream today? Because you called me transphobic before. Transphobic? Now you're calling me transphobic. Okay. Now nothing has changed. I can answer if you calm down and let me answer. All right, let's I can answer by asking a question. Do you believe what you believe today, yesterday? Yes. Then yes, you were to that conclusion before I flat out said it. Nah, yeah, he's he's right. Um, she can't prove that she came to that conclusion or had a valid reason to come to that conclusion. At least you can if you were good at debating and you actually like did your research. I'm sure there's a plethora of clips that you can probably try to flip. Um, was he just joking? More than likely, but Kef Luz, if she did her research, probably could have found more points to prove her argument. Kef Luz don't do that, though. So Kef Luz going to look stupid, more than likely. How did you come to that conclusion? How did I come to that conclusion? Because you said you're transphobic today and you just said you believe the same you're things today the that question. you did you're, yesterday. You're refusing to answer the question. You actually don't even know how to make an argument. It's so funny. For somebody that pretends to be what? a debater of trans issues online, wait, wait, you can't even prove how I was transphobic before this call today. I just told you I was transphobic. And you're saying, there you go. You're, there he goes, right? But you couldn't prove it yes, until I said it to you. I you like shaggy, you believe the same things you believed today, yesterday. If you believe the same things you believed today, yesterday, that means so that why you did had you call transphobic, transphobic on Twitch stream? Yesterday. Why'd you call me transphobic on Twitch stream? How did you come to that conclusion? What 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 led you to that conclusion? Look, are you crying? I don't think that either of us are going to be able to come to a reasonable conclusion. Are you crying? Why does he keep asking that? Like, I don't even hear any noise that would even make you think. <laughs> Yo, Fed, come on, we know it's blood spur, but bro, like you doing you know, basic techniques, like. Uh, Doing? Why do you keep asking that? <laughs> no. Are you crying? No, I'm not crying. You sound this like is you're a crying. No, this is just something that you do because <laughs> no. you want to with your dominance of the conversation. You're crying. Like you're unable to come at this from a logical perspective. You need to get you emotional. You haven't been able heated. to make a single you argument at all. Your, your argument is you you're a bad did. person. You are bet okay. Well, do you have anything to substantiate that? Or are you just gonna call, or are you just gonna paint labels and pretend like that's an argument? I never called you. A bad person. I had to you stop just real quick just to let y'all know that I need you to hit the like button. Oh, yeah. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe. Just check just now, just now, just check. YouTube be unsubscribing people or whatnot. Make sure that you sub and drop some comments. Put Fang in the comment sections. Let me know that you rock with me. Also, don't forget to check me out on Patreon. Helps me keep going. You never know, man. I might get canceled. You might come on here. I might be gone tomorrow. You never know. Check me out on Patreon to find exclusive content. You also get early access to a bunch of stuff as well. All right, back to the video with your anxious ass. What you know? Where, where are you going to that you got to rush? Play the video. Call me Something transphobic. You think that's a bad person. So explain to me why you thought that. Why I thought what? Why did you think I was transphobic on Tipster Stream? Why did I think you're transphobic? Because you are. I know this. That's You've not an answer. To it. You're not answering the Why question. You actually can't make an argument. Wait, you actually can't make an argument. There is a million things you could say to make an argument. You can't think of anything right now. Are you high on coke? Even that's crazy. Uh, even he's admitting, like, yes, there's a plethora of clips. <laughs> like I'm telling you, man. Like, yeah, it was, if you wanted to make that, that's not me saying that I agree with her statement at all. I think that she was wilding out for even saying some dumb stuff like that. But if you wanted to paint the narrative, there's a plethora of clips that you probably could have used. It easily would have got knocked down to as well, but she didn't even make the attempt, which means that she's just saying whatever she's saying without actually having a point.
Oh my god, dude! Are you really <laughs> doing that? I mean, I, I'm just I'm trying, I'm trying to figure out why you can't answer a simple question. You're trying to paint me as a bad person. And Explain to me question, why I'm a bad person. You've already answered the question. Yes, now. But explain to me like why you thought I was transphobic you? and tips are stream. I shouldn't have to make the argument for you. You should be able to make that yourself. If no, you're so confident you already, what you're saying. You already no, conceded to the point. So you won't why even was deal I with people. What have I done that's transphobic prior to the stream? Let's hear it. I, I'm, uh, let's, okay. Let's, All right. Tell okay. your chat to stop bed naming misgendering me. That is a good start. To My chat that you shits on me all the time. Yeah. Okay, so you're not willing. I wouldn't have said nothing. <laughs> what are you talking about? All right, like the only rule I have is don't self promote or don't promote. Don't be in here shouting out other creators too crazy, like things like that. Besides that, yeah, yeah, yeah I don't care. I don't, who cares? Willing to do that. Not a big My chat shits on me. They shit on anyone they want. That's not shitting on someone. That's bigotry. What do you mean? They shit me all the fucking time. They call like me short, and that is offensive it. to me. They call me short. Can you believe that? <laughs> that is pretty sad, isn't it? <laughs> okay, that's actually really funny. <laughs> <laughs> They're mean to me. <laughs> no, it's it's funny that you're trying to compare a form of bigotry to like being <laughs> short. <laughs> Come on, you no. laughed at that. You know, you know it's, what I'm doing here. It's funny because of how fucking dumb it is. Oh, come on. You know I'm you know what I'm doing right now. Because I know Don't because you got stupid. backed into a corner, so now you just have to I troll. backed into shit. It's I'm okay. fucking chilling right now. You're my the chat shits on me all the time. Hitler. They call me short, they call me Asian when I'm white, they deny my white sat and as a white supremacist, I think that's offensive. Um uh, this has actually been a really good <laughs> Are you going to upload this to your channel? No. Fuck! No, Why? This is good content. Because, because it's just kind of proved the point that I've already thought. What do you mean? How could I be an evil person? I'm making you laugh! I'm a good guy. I'm sharing laughter. Little- <laughs> What's wrong with this man? Yo, yeah, what's wrong with this boy? Um, I don't know if he's a good person or not. I'm be honest. I don't really care. Um, what I will say is that this conversation is pointless. Let's see. Let's get to the tipster moment, man. Like, dang. <laughs> they say, yeah, complimenting and whatnot, man. If you don't get up out of here with that. Now, fled a call for me and called tipster for backup. This is some really cool stuff right here. Hey, here come tipster. What's going on? What's up, tipster? Long time no talk. How you doing, man? The simster. I'm doing great, man. How are you? <laughs> I'm doing wonderful tonight. What I'm trying to understand is why are you guys so pissed about this when Bo Blax isn't even pissed about this? The whole it doesn't point matter. Me I'm allowed to Campbell, commentate over the whatever the fuck I me, want. No, you can commentate on whatever you want, but I'm telling it's you, like, I, it seems like you're moral fagging about something that Bo Blax Whoa, isn't even upset about. tipster, you can be using that language like that. What the fuck is that about? Why are you upset over oh, something yes, that Boblox isn't upset about? He's got the pass. Like, it, it doesn't matter if Boblox <laughs> is upset about it. I'm allowed to come to right. whatever the fuck I want. No, no, no. That's fine. That's fine. But like Boblox and I had a conversation this morning and he's like, yeah, dude, you know, that's I don't really see a problem like what you did or whatever. Like, you know, you were trying to mediate. That's irrelevant like, to me. That's the whole point of this. We were mediating. It doesn't matter. Yeah, I actually agree with all RC. It doesn't matter. If this is a topic and he's covering a topic, whether the two people involved in the topic squashed it behind the scenes or not, is irrelevant if he wants to cover his opinion on the topic he should be allowed to and for tipster to be a quote unquote journalist somebody that has done the most nastiest stuff i'm talking about he leaks phone calls dms all types of stuff that's why he deleted his dms from discord because he knew it was about to get leaked i wonder if i should leak some of the dms i got oh you think i ain't had that shit screenshotted for years i've had of course um with him i definitely archived it he's disgusting um, but yeah, man, um, that's how he get down. That's how he get down. And he's just a clown for the conversation. So you guys are making a big fucking deal, making it seem like I backstab Bo Blacks or some shit. When the whole purpose of that conversation was just to mediate a conversation between him and Keffels. That's irrelevant to me. It doesn't matter what Bobak right. thinks. I'm allowed to commentate. So you don't actually have an argument. You don't actually have an argument. Then. No, my argument okay, is cool. I'm allowed to commentate over whatever the fuck I want. If I, no, if this call can takes place. Whatever you want. I just don't understand why like this is such a big deal when the person who's supposed to be Are you the really sitting there as a commentator YouTuber deal. going, what's the big deal, man? I'm a lo- what are you saying, dude? Like, that's, that's nothing. 
I also like how you like told oh, your pivot. audience okay. about like cool. the ca- the so you lost situation. that point to so just pivot to something else. But okay, let's hear. No, let's, no, no. I'm just saying like I like how you told your audience about the Colton situation and like I already apologized to him publicly and so? I-, I think in the Colton situation, just to give you a brief explanation in case you don't know who none of these guys is. I think that's some creator or some person who'll be floating around the community uh, the commentary who was having some bad thoughts, some really negative thoughts. And let it be known that they were contemplating doing some bad things to themselves. And Tipster took it upon himself to go out his way to contact this person's friends and say, don't check up on him. I think he's lying. Don't call and get no like hospital or doctor sent to his house. He's lying. Turns out this person was not lying and actually ended up hospitalized for some time based off of mental stuff. Tips is a piece of crap. If he was actually friends with this person, he would have told them, yes, go get help. I have had people who have spread nasty, disgusting lies on me. And then they did a live stream and told people that they had these thoughts. And I called in and said, hey, F the live stream, go get help. And I was treated like I was a bad guy. I was even able to tell someone I dislike they need to go see professional help. Tipster told, well, then not only tell the person anything, but tell other people to not help them and not persuade them to go get help or even do a check-in or whatever they call them things. Tipster is a piece of crap. I've been telling people this from day one, but ain't this the Mr. Mental Health guy though? How many mental health breaks have Tipster took this year long? A lot, right? A whole lot. That's what Tipster does. That's what Tipster does, man. He's a nasty, nasty man. Nasty, filthy, horrible person, bro. Privately. I talked about that. So, what do you, so mean? you don't. So you don't. So you don't actually have any arguments about anything. Uh, wh- hello, because you apologize five months later yeah, here's on a, a hidden live stream that I had to fucking pay for to watch because you didn't clip it or post about any of that shit on Twitter. Somehow that means I can't criticize you. I mean, what are you? Can what I, are what I, are, are you, you, you making right now? Can I, can I ask you a question about something? Why is it that when I left the commentary community back in February, you guys oh, didn't give man. a fuck, but all of a sudden you found out I'm friends with Keffels? Now it's a problem because you started tagging me, saying that my community is the reason that you left, and they made you want to. Yeah, and that's not true. They did care, actually. Everyone kept asking, checking on you. Every time something happens to Tipster within that community, his quote unquote friends would check on him or at least speak on it and things. They would also roast him and pretty much encourage their communities to talk about his wife, but they would check on him after the fact. Commentary community. Fucking kill yourself. Ooh, That's fucking crazy. I, I mean, your community's fucking life. cancer. It's like, why would I want anything to do so with why your would fucking you, dog oh, shit? I community? actually have a question. You were a part of that. Was cr- he built his entire fan base off of that community? People were not watching Tipster because they like Tipster. No, he has the personality of a twig. He's the size of of the Michelin man. Anyway. Anyway, I digress. He can, you know, he, no, he can help you. He just chooses not to. I digress. I digress, fam. Tipster is, is nasty. Question for you. So why wouldn't you, when you, you were, when I was asking for examples of what my community has done to you, why would you bring up the example that quote unquote, my, when you went on dead on Dave stream, my community was like digging up your wife's Instagram. Why did you make that argument? Even though I made that argument on dead on Dave stream in like November. Because I was trying to like leave civilly with you guys. Like I wanted oh, to go my own way, but I didn't want to pussyfoot around a conversation. Be- yeah. you don't no, 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 shit. no, 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 that's uh, exactly. He was trying to pussyfoot around a conversation because he knew he wanted to be able to keep getting the views from being friends with you guys and kissing your butt without actually being friends with you guys. So he tried to dip out cordially. That way he could still do his live streams. And whenever you're not streaming, your fans would go and watch him. Now he's probably lost some subscribers, especially after this. Like whatever subscribers was rocking with him, just because he was a uh, friend with Augie or Nicholas Diorio or anybody within the commentary community, they're probably long gone. And then his numbers are going to take an effect. It's going to look like Illuminati's channel. Actually, way worse because he uh, never really was hitting like that.
McCain to the viewership. That's why he has to kiss uh, Keffel's butt. He has to. He has no choice because he has to move off of her fan base and woke fan base now because he has no other option. Oh, you asked me a question. Oh, I'm trying to got. fucking answer it. I'm okay. trying, I was trying to leave this community civilly like, hey, you know what? I'm going to go my own way, but I don't want any beef with you guys. And you guys couldn't have it that way. I you asked had to turn you it into a what fucking the issue. fuck my community did and you couldn't answer shit. You had no what? argument. You could have just said that y'all trolled me and I well, couldn't Your community has been calling me like a fucking pedophile ever since you covered the lollycon That's shit. Right. Your you community has been talking about how I cheated on my fucking wife because That's you told your community big X to doubt tips are Yeah, he never brought that up at all, which is weird. And is that Augie's community that was doing that? Either way, it's wrong. Either way, that's wrong. Y'all know how I get down. I don't like that. I don't like that. That's nasty. That's, you, you should never. Yeah, that's, that's foul. <laughs> that's, that's mad foul. That's mad foul. I don't care what community. Yeah, no, that's, that's just horrible, bro. That's, that's really horrible. And it shouldn't be allowed, right? Um, but... Remember, I told you that's how all the RC community is, though. I told you that. I blatantly told you that's exactly what his his community do. That's what they do, fam. Because it's fun to them. They can even know it's not true. They don't care. You, talk to, on his you talk to random women on fucking Twitter when you're a married man. Do you, you not understand message, that you literally message you women? Now, do you hear this incel? I just want to let you. Do you hear how that's you talk to to women? And you're a married man. So gossip channel, these drama channels and gossip and tea channels are the same. That's none of your fucking business. <laughs> I don't even like Tipsy, but I got to call this pay to pay, right? Like, don't frame it like that, right? Like, I would say, yo, you're simping, bro. And, I, and out of me being a friend, which Augie was, I don't like the fact that you're simping. I think you should do better, right? Like, do that. You were talking to the woman. We don't know him and his wife's relationship. Like, and nor do I care. I just like making fun of him, to be honest. I genuinely don't don't actually care about Tipster's wife or Tipster at that, to be honest. Like I Tipster's just hot and bothered whenever I roast him. I genuinely do not care. It's not something that's a big deal to me. I understand I that people's you. relationships have different you, boundaries and shit. Like yeah, I, I don't understand buy the if, like, boundary. Maybe I don't if you buy were it. in a marriage, like that would be like the boundary. But like my wife doesn't Most care about any of this shit. Boundaries is that they don't let their fucking married husband flirt with other women at the middle of the night on well, Discord okay, all if night that's long. Your boundary well, that's you know, oh, that sounds cr It's like that goes against what you normally like represent, right? If a female was to come into your chat and say that exact complaint to you about tipster a few months or maybe even years ago, you would have called her all types of woke feminist bitches, right? And I would agree with you. So now why is it okay that now once you don't like tipster, now you want to start pointing these things out? No, he was always, a, tipster was always a simp since day one. This isn't news. It's just that people are calling it out now because he's woke now. Like, well, he's always been woke. But it's become cool within the commentary community to acknowledge the truth, even though I've been saying it for years. And there's some people who are in the commentary community or just in certain communities in general that still to this day have beef with me. But if you was to ask them why, it really is because of Tipster. And they refuse to just admit that BXB Spoy was right. Three, when that's you get a, married, that's, whenever the fuck, that's a normal battery, whenever the most fuck you lose sure. your virginity and get married, then that's oh, fair. Wow. But like my marriage is different. Are you mad? Why do you give a fuck about what happens in my marriage? I don't give a fuck. It's nah, funny. I wouldn't care. So <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck is even is that then? That's the thing. Uh, he doesn't care. He also yeah, doesn't have any doesn't consistent positions. No. no. You haven't given a single argument this entire call. Okay. I mean, I have, but I can give another one. What's up? So as I was saying with Leafy, do you think Leafy should be deplatformed? No. Why? <laughs> Why would he give me an argument that he should? I'm anti deplatforming. Well, okay. Well, um, in our call, you said verbatim if somebody's advocating for rape, then probably, yeah. I mean, I have a pretty open door policy <laughs> when it comes to speech. Obviously, there are exceptions, like pedophiles, for instance, they should go as well. I would probably say advocating violence this because, you know, some crazy nut job or something could hear you and then blow up a school or something. The careful is just on some other ish. Um, 
I don't even know if I'm gonna clip this. I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> At this point, I, I don't even know. I don't even know, man. So, Leafy's called for a transgender Holocaust on his stream. Oh my so, god! Are you gonna take that seriously? Against it, you're Leafy is here. This you fucking troll from positions. 2016. You're sitting there thinking that he said transgender Holocaust. You're like, <gasps> he did. I have he wants clip. them to be Do killed. Want? Do you? On, I, I've heard the clip. Do you honestly believe that that's a real, genuine position that he has? Oh, okay, but that wasn't your position. Your position was that some nut job could hear it and blow up a school or something. Do you think a nut job would hear that and then be able to discern if it's a real position or a troll? No, I don't think you're responsible for that. That's what I mean. You're a coward. You don't actually stand for what you believe in. What do you mean? You probably if I was a coward, with, I would be bowing down to both of you right now and be cowering in the con Oh, yeah, I guess that's pretty bad. Or no, I'm not saying that. I'm saying that Why no. Why do you, you think everyone for that. wants you to bow? Like, do you have a submission fetish? Are you like that kind of freak? Because like, I'll accept <laughs> you if that's true. But come on, man. I mean, I don't just, want anyone to bow to me. That's and Tips to laugh at that? Time? Like Yo, the butt kissing that tips to be doing is crazy, bro. And he laughed at that. Like, that was hot fire. It's hilarious, but that's just not a fucking response wow. to anything that I've said. I've already given you your own positions, things that you have said verbatim that go I against things that position. you are saying. You don't hold consistent positions. I no. hold very consistent positions and I'm based. And you haven't. I would say that he does have some inconsistencies. It's just that Kefla ain't good at calling it out. Like, I called out at least during this reaction on me listening to it like two off the top. <laughs> off the top. It was not hard at all for me to be like, okay, boom, boom. Yep, this was wrong. This wasn't it, pimp. This wasn't it. I right hear, man. This goes against your normal, your black pill stuff you be talking. But presented a single argument this entire call, so I don't know. I mean, I like that you added fucking. Uh, oh, you're getting you're getting backed into a corner, and you're like, "Oh, I'm wrong," and everyone else is full of shit because you can't defend what you're saying. You just asked me if I think leave should be deplatformed. I said no. That goes against what you've stated that you believe. I don't believe that he should be deplatformed. What are you saying? You're you just yeah. got nothing. I don't believe you're he should be deplatformed. You're saying that you think that people oh should be deplatformed if they advocate for violence, and Leafy has advocated for violence. And if he saw this clip on his stream, he would probably say, "Yes, you dude, I advocate you for violence." Hear, seriously, are you that like? Yeah. Are you that retarded? You just hear everything like. Oh, I, think I mean, maybe if I only hang around with Holocaust or whatever, poison you really people? take that seriously, honestly, answer that question. Or are you just looking for an excuse to get him off the fucking internet because he makes you fucking sore? He well, upsets oh, no, you. no, no, no. I don't care about deplatforming him. I just want you to be uh, consistent. I don't think so. I yeah, think you're I looking for any excuse you want to get him fucking banned because he makes you sore because he makes fun of you. Yeah, I call it cap. I think they definitely want to deplatform him and anyone who disagrees, to be honest. And it hurts your feelings. I get made fun of every fucking day by thousands of people. I don't care. Then why do you like, care about my chat? Shit on me, then the why do you care about my chat? You just brought that up earlier. You see, this is what I mean. You're going to sit yeah. there and say, that I have no positions, but your position is the most inconsistent because shit on the fucking hate planet. Speech, Augie. Oh, really? Oh, hate speech. Wow. That's hilarious. So you do care? Yeah. I mean, no, but that's a thing. You're a pussy. That's not an argument. You, you do are care. <laughs> what the fuck yeah. is being a pussy? Because. If you were like your heroes, like Medicare, you would just say, yeah, it's hate speech and I don't give a fuck. Is that his hero? <laughs> Fam, it, it sucks that I guess, well, you can't say it sucks, but um, I don't really have any YouTube heroes. I guess I came into YouTube a little bit differently. The purpose was to always be myself since day one. Like, in fact, I never wanted to do uh, edited content. I always did live streams. I was a rapper who was just like, let me just talk some ish. Um, but it was never like, let me be like this. I never idolized someone and copied them or anything of that nature. But I don't know. Is that his like idol? Is that someone who he watched a lot or something like that? Who knows? I don't believe in hate speech. I'm sorry. <laughs> Do you have anything else? Like, what the fuck is this? I like how you added tipster as like a last, you like pussied out, you panicked, you're like, oh, you added no, tipster to the call. I asked her to add me to the call. 
What's up, tipster? You had nothing too. I asked her to add me to the call because I think it's really ridiculous that you guys are making a big deal about this when Bo Black says and he doesn't have a problem. That's with a it. wonderful argument. So many Who people cares? talking about how like I Not backstab Bo Blacks or some shit. And meanwhile, the whole purpose of that conversation was me setting up a boundary with Bo Blacks, just saying, "Hey, you know what? Can you not involve oh, yeah. me in this uh, problem between the two of you?" And then, like on top of that. I was trying to mediate the situation between them because I thought it was a misunderstanding. Yeah, so I, I failed to I see how I'm care. the I failed to no, see how I'm the bad guy here when I was trying to mediate the conversation between the two of them. Tips, yeah. I'm not my criticism of you isn't that you mediated a conversation between them. I just thought you did a shit job of doing it. I thought your arguments were retarded. And that's fair. That's a fair criticism. Okay, then you what are you mad about? Shit job moderating it. I'm just saying, like everybody's acting like I backstab Bo Blacks, mm. and that's not what fucking happened. I mean, you were letting Kethel just completely smear his image online, even though you've defended Bobox in the past when similar people have made similar arguments, you know? Oh, nice. Kethel's, by the way, just kicked Nick Dior out of the call. Kethel's is a pussy. Oh, shit. Damn. So you add tips to the call, but when I add other people, you won't let them in? This bring so in someone stupid. else. Bring in, bro. Are you mad? This is so dumb. But it's so dumb. You bring Nicholas Diario. Let's see what he got to say. If he got anything, I don't think so. He's just gonna say smug comments. <laughs> but it should be fair. It should be two versus one. Bring bring his homie in, and then that way y'all can have a four way match. And are okay. you mad? Are you mad? <laughs> I'm gonna add Nick to the call again. Why you keep asking? Me? She's mad. Yo, what's up, Nick? What the hell, man? <laughs> Are you mad? Okay, you got in with the second time was funny, but go ahead, add him back. <laughs> okay. Uh, Fair enough. <laughs> that was funny. Whatever. See, I have a sense of humor. I can do for it. Oh, yeah. wait my turn. What's up, Nick? Hey, Nick. What's up? Hello. Hey, man. How you doing, bro? I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty passing. good, too, man. It was, you, there's a have you been listening to the call right now? <laughs> I missed yeah, basically yeah, the whole good. stream. How's everybody doing? Great. That's I'm doing great. How are you, man? Long so he just seen them on the call and was like, I got to get in on this. I need that in my life. <laughs> time listener, first yeah, time caller. <laughs> yeah. What's good, man? Um, not much. Um, so, yeah, I guess like Tipster is really mad because... I guess you're saying that you don't know why people are mad about like the Bo Blacks thing, but I, I, I feel like you do. Haven't you been firing I mean, off I think replies to every single like yeah. person in your comment section? Like, for instance, in response to Augie bringing up me, people are spamming in chat TTD, which stands for total turn death. Like that's not what it stands for. I don't what know what the fuck that them? means. Only what you do. That's not what that what stands, stands like for. You read more Kiwi farms than I do. Stands for. I don't actually even know how to get on it now that it's not on the clear net. Okay. Stands for total tipster domination. Oh, it stands for total tipster it. domination. It stands for total tipster domination. The chat's actually pro tipster right now. I don't know if you knew this, but my chat's actually been really against me since I've started the tipster arc. So they're actually cheering okay, for tipster. <laughs> it's just so sad. Like tipster, isn't it sad how much of a pussy he is? He can't stand for apples. So this is the most pointless conversation, my man. I'm about to get up and start folding laundry or something. Kefels, you, you literally just met. kicked Nick out He's twenty times in a row. <laughs> well, you just added <laughs> Nick. Or yeah, you added Tipster. I did. Oh, I love the way. Are you a pussy? You gotta, you gotta oh, love no. way, you gotta love the pussy. way they over exaggerate. Like the oh, way no. that Nick said, I'm responding to every comment and. Like, Tipster, you loved it when you was down with them. You joined them in it. What do you tell? You probably taught them how to do this. <laughs> Yo, Tipster's such a clown. He don't got to get mad at something that he did a thousand times once it's being done to him, isn't it? You got to love and you That's what you do, Tipster. Hey, that didn't happen, but okay. What's up, Nick? Welcome back. How can you find meth on the dark web, but you can't find Kiwi Farms? <laughs> Tipster. I feel like I mean, that's a little different. You think it's a bit different? Yeah. Oh. Kefels, this you know is not I going think? your favor at all. I have to be honest. You I, think I, think you, I think you pulled into my stream thinking you could own me. I 1v2'd both of you easily, and now you just look like a fucking retard. Augie. Like, what did you think would happen? Augie, you called I'm talking in. to Nick. Okay, okay, talk to Nick. Fair enough. I will I will mute. I'll let you speak. Because I wanted to tell I wanted to say Nick. 
Are you going to make the same leafy pitch to me? Are you going to try to like um, Darth Vader me onto your side? No, no, I just think that the drug jokes are not nice. I love them. And listen, I agree with your pitch. I think you're right. I think Augie's being a cock. All right. I'm going to talk oh. to Leafy. I'm going to get in his ear. I'm going to give him exactly what he needs to hear. Okay. I think he's looking too big. I'm not a fan of this whole transgenocide thing myself. If he could settle for just taking you out, then I think that we could all like call a spade a spade. I recently yeah. saw a picture of you, Nick, and I got to say, I think you should be more worried about That's running funny. your legs. Running I've your seen mouth. a lot of pictures of you. That's really fucking creepy. Well, why? What is going on with this sector of the drama sphere? Where? What is happening here? With that? Hey, 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 yo! Oh! You guys, oh! You guys like it? Nick, 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 I know that you're having a hard time with the ladies. Don't you ever. Don't you as ever, don't ever step closer to the mic like that and whisper into somebody's ear that you ever seen pictures of them. Don't don't you ever fix your face to do that. That's crazy, bro. That that's that's real wild, bro. That's it. Somebody gonna clip that. That's gonna be a new um donation <laughs> donation sound. They're gonna play that drink. That sounded nasty. That was nasty. A lot of pictures of you. That's really fucking creepy. I <laughs> <laughs> didn't say it like what that. What the fuck am I listening to? Yeah, that was weird as hell. Am, am I supposed to be impressed? Impressed by what? What? I, I don't know. This call is so retarded. Holy shit. Did you get who you wanted, Keffels? Did this go in so your favor? Yeah, in Have you figured out why, yeah. why the community thought you were like a pedo or something? Did you figure out that was your fault too? I mean, I was just trying to understand. You see, yo, uh, these yo, these guys are nasty. These guys are disgusting. The way they just throw that out there so loosely. Just throw it out there. And yes, y'all had a part to play with that. Like, what? That's just that's nasty. That's, it, was, it was both both sides. But to be honest, you shouldn't be throwing no false allegation on nobody. If y'all are his friends, y'all would come out to help him nip that in a butt. But because y'all nasty, y'all promoted it. Understand what was the logic behind that situation, and somehow that got spun into me defending Lollycon. Yeah, because you you got flogged by fucking uh, Salvo pancakes for like six months. And then you had your uh, little lollycon death spree punch out moment where you went on Donkey Kong Jr. and made a really retarded video. I mean, what do you, what do you think it's, people it's are going to say? Donkey Kong Country. Get it right, my dude. Best okay. game ever made. Best game ever made. I mean, you only got like... You should know that. You're a gamer, bro. You're, you're a gamer, bro. You should know that, dude. I, I never played it. I, <laughs> I'm beyond with you. I ain't never played. I don't know. You like, know it because it's like one of your PS3 three games shit? that you play, but I guess I just didn't watch you very much. Yeah, dude. I mean, you constantly watch my streams to keep tabs on everything I do, so you should be an expert at this point, right? Absolutely. I'm A-logging. That's what A-logs do. Yeah. What were you calling it? Tipster Watch when you did that stream the other day? That's yeah, weird. it was too boring. I had to talk about Edwin. But Yeah, you bitched about my soundboard. I love my soundboard. My soundboard's great. Tipster, nobody in your audience likes your soundboard. Everyone's telling you to you trash it off. address your soundboard. <laughs> The soundboard is trash. I ain't going front. And it's corny. It's because Tipster doesn't have enough of a personality, right? So he's trying to use something else to help him with personality. Like if I get a soundboard, it's gonna be stuff that's related to what I'm already doing. We kind of got like a miniature soundboard on what I'm using right now currently to do this video. Um, so even if you could tell, most of the clips I use are inside jokes or clips of me saying something, or clips of me telling someone they're nasty or Loose small things like that, right? Like uh, stuff like this. <laughs> He's mad. They're not giving me a chance. <laughs> I can't really control what he says. I edited the hell out of that. Got to get back on that type of time. Um, but yeah, right. I'm, I'm not mad at a soundboard if it's being done 
to add to the show in a productive way with tipster it's because he's trash so he's using the soundboard to save him from being trash but guess what everyone knows what you're doing tipster like i'm just being honest <laughs> you're not talented tipster you only you build your fan base off of your friends tipster i mean i i, I don't know um <laughs> what, what do you want me to say I don't know, dude. This is just fucking pathetic, man. I mean, this is just a really embarrassing yeah, I showing. Think the- I ain't bringing Garth out. I was just showing an example. Garth ain't going to come out just to roast tipster. The way that you guys have obsessed about pathetic, me for the past three months, going on eat. three months, is pretty pathetic. No, I don't think it's, it's pathetic on my end. I've been making you. hella money. Everyone thought I took the W. You guys just came in and just coped. I mean, Keffels couldn't make an argument. Tipster called in. I own tipster completely because tipster couldn't bring up the real issues that he wanted to bring up. It's funny that you guys talk about me being a pussy about my well, position. What do you mean I couldn't bring I up the real issue? issue? What because do you mean when I, I asked you what my issue, community exactly. did to you, you wouldn't answer, even though we had to dig up and find I mean, I can already previously answer, but the problem of you is accusing my community of right, calling you a pedophile or digging up the white skin. By the way, Tipster, you got to name who in my community. Tipster, do you want to name who in my community dug up your wife's Instagram, or did that just never fucking happen? I don't know who did it. If I'm oh, interesting. Yikes. Well, curious to be, because to be fair, dead on, to Dave, be, on dead on fair, Dave, uh, like six months ago, and you said be, it was from the fair, RFC. No, 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 no. Let me finish. You asked me a question. Let me finish. All right. In fairness to you, I don't necessarily know if it's one of the members of your. <laughs> Yo, yeah, I got high at the government. No, 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 no. False alarm. False alarm. False alarm, man. I should have let the whole thing play. So it's because I'm of me. You, that's why I act the way I act, bro. Like when it comes to like. If I see some fake shit, I'm going to shit on somebody. I'm going to let them know because that type of stuff, that tells me right there that you social climbing and you're playing a certain type of game right there. That's what that tells me. Especially if you can't man up and come to me and be on some, yo, my bad, bro. You was right. Because I never had an issue with this person. Even when they were trying to come at me, my only, I was like, what the fuck? Where did that come from? Like my problems with Tipster, how did you get involved? And it was just because Tipster, we keep tagging them and asking them for help, right? So, but now they're shitting on tipsters. So if they were a real man, they would come to me and be on some straight up shit like, yo, my bad, yo, my bad, let's squash that shit, right? If they was on some real man shit, but if they on some sucker shit, I just feel bad for their fans that think they're a genuine person or that they're bare minimum believe in anything that they say. But I'm not going to go too hard. It's not a beef. There's no issue on my side. I just think that's fake as fuck. And my supporters seen that shit since day one. So they know exactly what I'm talking about. That's some fake shit. That's fake as fuck. It is what it I is. Mean, the, the I mean, the timing uh, adds up. You, it's a, it's a same, you don't want to make it's you know, like a solid way. position it's, there, but you'll accuse me of not same, having a solid position. I think it's, it's just same, hilarious. It's the, the same way. And, 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 keep in mind, and keep in mind, Augie, you know about this one because mm-hmm. I sent you a screenshot of it. How somebody posted oh, really? my docs in my Discord server well, and they said that they were going to send screenshots of the DMs. You deleted all your DMs with me, so I let, can't even let, look let back me, and fact check finish. that. Are you not going to let me finish? All right, I'm about no. to let me finish. I, I'm about to get a shirt that says BX Beast Boy see the future, bro. I'm on some that so Raven shit the way I be predicting these things. I be predicting the hell out of the future. Sent you a screenshot of somebody in my Discord server posting my docs and saying they were going to send a copies, printouts of the fucking even the, the screenshots or whatever from the AP situation to my wife. And you're like, damn, that sucks. I'm sorry, no, dude. No, no, no. That wasn't from my community, though. You never. But tips that that's kind of you admitting that your wife isn't okay with this, though. If you were that worried about it, that means that you you lied and your wife doesn't know about you flirting with these chicks. Bonzi. But that's none of my fucking business. I don't care. I mean, yeah, is if she is, if she isn't, he can handle that. Right. That's not my criticism. I just don't think that um he should be telling people advice when he's a simp. He's one of the biggest simps on YouTube since day one. Psychic beast boy facts. Never made the argument. I remember what you're talking about. How do you know about. it's yeah, not never from your the community? Ar- the guy Bro, literally said never he made saw it on your stream. It my community. He literally said he saw it on your stream. Are you mad? You never made the argument. It's from my community. You asked me a question. I'm trying to answer it, and you're like talking over me. Yeah, you asked what me you're how saying do I have proof right like your community is lying? Right shit. Tipster, the motherfucker who said that shit literally said he watched your stream. You're lying, right now. Are you really an alcoholic? He said he literally grabbed the screenshots from your fucking stream. Do you want me to why you're lying right now? You're lying right now because I remember that conversation. You never said that was somebody from my community. You said something that they randomly literally my said in the screenshot some that they pulled it from your that? stream. Okay, so some random, you know, fifty thousand fucking people viewed that stream, right? So I'm responsible for that now. That's why you left the community. You That's asked an example how of I knew it was somebody from your community. community I'm telling you? you how I knew it was somebody from your community. So not from my community, just somebody that watched my stream. There's a difference there. 
Do you have a healthy you relationship mean? with did shots? You ever give me, by the way, did you ever give me a name so that I could wow. be this person? Nah, probably not. I sent you the screenshot. Where? Well, yeah. I I, I don't remember where I sent it to you, but I, I know you your, sent it. I, I sent checked you that your screenshot. Discord. You probably sent it on Discord and then because you wiped Discord, now you got no proof of nothing. But if he sent that to you, Augie, then yeah, you you kind of foul for that. <laughs> That's shady as hell. That's shady. And you literally just, all of them. But then no one tips it. He's really passive aggressive. He'll just distance himself and then won't say nothing. Right. Which is okay. Right. I'm kind of straight up. I'm going to let you know how I feel. And then I'm a distance. I'll cut you off so quick. Right. I'm going to let you know what's up. And then I'm like, all right, now we ain't got to really say nothing to each other. You know what I mean? Uh, all right. Now I'll take nothing personal by it at all. Tipster is just going to run and then he's going to do sneaky shit. And he's going to do like a lot of female traits because that's that's tipster. That's how he gets down, man. That's how he gets down. You literally just said that I sent you the screenshot because you said you remember that conversation. I sent you the screenshot of the person. Who I did remember it. that you told me that somebody that watched my VOD sent this shit to your wife. I said that was horrible. You never. So gave even me a you name. said yourself that they you never okay, gave me a name. Um, you never give me a name. Are you well, who was I, tequila who in the, the fuck Was I supposed to ban? Who the fuck was I supposed to ban? I didn't even ask you to ban anyone. I just so showed then you what like, argument at that time I was just showing you a what random happened. person That's watched my content that did something mean to you. And That's therefore fair. I'm responsible for the abuse that my community did. Do you see yeah. how this doesn't make any fucking sense? That's what he's trying to like, say. Like we've already established that Augie isn't a good faith actor. He's never going to respond. Devils, I've been more than good though. faith to of you tonight. Not. He's not. I've allowed I'm you to like, in every conversation you brought up. Double. You haven't answered shit. You're a fucking pussy. You, you, you can't, a you can't, can't do anything. Scrub, you Who can't do anything. A good faith actor in this call. <laughs> I've been a good faith actor. I will stand by that. You haven't answered shit, Captain. I mean, you I'm sure like a fucking creep This was like a you massive hell. I don't know why the fuck, fuck you would think calling into my shirt tonight it would have worked. Welcome to RFC, bitch. You got Augie, fucked. You Augie, got do you actually want to listen and hear? Because no. I can tell you. Are like, you going to tell me? I think neither side wants to listen and hear. This has been just blood sport the entire time without really no context. I had to add a bunch of content just because I'm aware of some of this stuff, even though I'm not looking that deep into it. It'll just come across my timeline or somebody would be talking about it. And I'm like, oh, wow, this is crazy. One of the things, one of those. I mean, that Dylan, how long are we even talking? Yes, 30 can. minutes? Are you going to actually can. make an argument now? Okay, let's hear it. I've made plenty of arguments and I've already proved you're ridiculous. And anyone you who actually shit. has a motive of intelligence in your chat already Keep thinks you're the chat you made an argument. There's a believe reason you. that your chat is mostly incels. But wow, anyway, that really hits deep. Point. You said, <laughs> what did I say that was transphobic before tonight? You said that Dylan Mulvaney was a man in your chat. I have the screenshot. Post it. Can you just be honest? Post it. I will. Post it now. This no. is the first. No. I'll oh, you made that later. up. Oh, you made that up. You're a fucking I didn't make loser. it up. <laughs> post it right now or you're a bitch. How am I being a post loser? Post it right now you're a bitch. Okay, I had enough. Like, how long is this going? <laughs> Are they going to go to something? Let me see. How long does this last? Yeah, it looks like it's about to end. I let it go. Post it right the fuck now, or you're a complete bitch. Post it now. Now, do you tell me that you're not willing to be honest? Oh, about something that you don't have the screenshot, do you? you? Oh, as we say, oh, you're making using shit gender up. correct you're insults. You're making shit up. So. Oh, man. That's just so embarrassing. Why would you think that that would work on me? It just doesn't. It's. You said you this. got fucked. You're you literally got fucked up in this me call. and you're lying you're to your chat. Me. Is that your excuse for losing a debate between me? Yeah. How embarrassing. How embarrassing. This ain't really a debate debate. It's a blood sport. Yeah, you're you're fucked really up. Sad. You made a big mistake yeah. calling in tonight. I'll tell you that. Why? Because, because I'm going to get a fucked clogged? up completely. You no, I'm going to find out about the alcoholism allegations. You failed. It's over. I failed how? I mean, the screenshot exists. Yeah, I can true. easily show it, but I'm going to wait oh, until I'm off the stream. Oh, no, to, ma to manufacture it, of course. There you go. Okay, I'm done. I think eventually they end up leaving the call. I, I just don't care to stay here and listen to it. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm going to be honest with you. I'm, I'm done. I think I put you guys through enough.